Hi, I'm Roy Robertson. This is Good Business San Diego with our guest this morning, Brent Wilsey. Brent is the president of Wilsey Asset Management, and he's been developing investment strategies for individual clients and corporate clients for many years. Brent's based right here in San Diego and offers free financial planning workshops, including one coming up this Thursday evening at Scripps Ranch, and you're invited to attend. We'll tell you how in just a second. So Brent, uh, what we're talking about today is what you call the silent portfolio killer. Sounds mm -hmm. ominous. We're talking about inflation. Inflation. So people why get, is this such a risk? People get so wrapped up in the day-to-day -day movements of the stock markets, they're up and down. Oh, I lost you know, 10 percent this year and so yeah. forth. Stop. Look at where you're going to be 5, 10, 15, 20 years from now with the equities because inflation, even at 2.1 percent, can just eat away at your returns. You end up saying, gosh, my retirement is not that good. Why inflation that you don't see every day? And we've talked about this before, the fact that so many investors are just barely outpacing inflation, barely mm -hmm. keeping their, I mean, you're really just treading water at that point right. when these averages are just a little bit more than in the inflation rate uh, over the last 20 mm -hmm. years or so, right? Yeah, and what we have, Roy, we have a, what's called a nominal return. So if you get a 5% return, that's a nominal return. But let's look at the real return. So say inflation's 3%, yeah. you're now left with 2%. And oh my gosh, let's not forget about taxes. You pay taxes on that 3%, you get a 1.4% return. Inflation can eat away at your, your retirement very quickly, even though sure. you don't see it because you don't realize it until you retire. And this is all tied, of course, to the, the cost of goods and services through the years. Mm -hmm. and, uh, you're putting yourself at risk. And uh, another way that you may be doing so is with bonds. If you're uh, heavily weighted in bonds, a lot of people approaching retirement feel as though that's the way to go, but there's risks with bonds. Yeah, there's a misnomer uh, in, in the investment world that because you're older, you have to have bonds. Yeah. Bonds are a terrible investment. Right now, you get 3 to 4%. That is not very good. We just talked talk about a 5% return, which you're left with. 3 per 4% return, you may be at best break even. What you have to do is you have to look at saying, hey, I'm going to go into equities. I know they're going to be more volatile, but I use somebody like Brent Wilsey. He picks out the right companies yeah. that do it. And inflation, what is inflation? It's the rising prices of goods. Well, if you own those companies, guess what? You get to benefit from the rising cost of goods because you own those companies. And so there are opportunities in, in equities, and I know you want to talk about dividends too, mm -hmm. to be able to out, outpace in play, inflation. Yeah. Yeah. We have a company in our portfolio, we've now had it for about eight years. When we first bought it, the dividend yield was about 3%. What businesses do is they increase their dividends as time goes on. We now get a 17% yield on that company because we bought it eight years ago to a great business. You won't get that in bonds. It'll stay the same for as long as you own that bond. And so I mentioned you've got a seminar coming up this Thursday mm -hmm. in Scripps Ranch. And uh, you can call 858-546-4306 or go to smartinvesting2000.com to register for this. You're going to be talking about your individualized concentrated value portfolio. Give us just a little bit of a rundown as to what sure, that sure. is. That's how we build this to prevent, uh, protect against inflation. Is we're looking at companies that can actually do this. And we build this portfolio as a concentrated portfolio. Portfolio. It's individualized, so everybody has their own portfolio. We're not putting you in mutual funds right. or ETFs or blind pools. You actually see what you own your portfolio, and it's managed specifically just for your own portfolio. And I know another thing that you want people to guard against is excessive trading, too much mm -hmm. fluctuation. But mm -hmm. here we are halfway through the year, so every six months, is this a good time to kind of take stock of where we are? It, it, it really is, and, and we do a quarterly event uh, every quarter for our clients to show where they stand and so forth. But yeah, that, that's what you do is got to stay on top of it. Okay, great. And uh, the, uh, the seminar, of course, is free for anybody that's watching, all well, they need to do is place that call to 858-546-4306 or go online to smartinvesting2000.com. Uh, there's a lot to learn, particularly about inflation and that risk. Learn more by going to this free seminar.